So you've downloaded the 3D Game Kit Wise project. Now what? Let's talk about putting your own custom sounds into the game. I'll assume you've downloaded the 3D Game Kit Wise project, but if not, you can find it at www.engineaudio.com slash wiseprojects. Once everything's downloaded, in there you'll find a copy of the game and also the Wise project we'll need. Go ahead, take some time, play through the game, check out all of the sounds, and then once you're ready to go, we'll need to start out by downloading a copy of WISE. We'll start out by going to www.audiokinetic.com, find the button that says Get WISE, and then press Download WISE. You'll see a big button that says Download WISE Launcher, press that to get started. Once you have downloaded and installed the WISE Launcher, open it up and go to the WISE tab. There you can install the newest version of WISE, Make sure the latest version is selected and press install. Next, you will see the WISE install screen. At this point, we only need to select the authoring tool to install. We can go ahead and press next. Next, you will see a plugins page. We don't need any plugins for this project, so you can go ahead and uncheck each one of them. Once done, you can press the install button. This will take some time to finish the WISE install, but once complete, you can close the WISE launcher. Now that we played the game for a bit, let's identify a really easy sound to switch out and test. We're going to try the jump sound effect because it's very easy to trigger in the game. All we need to do is press the space bar. I always like to record my voice saying whatever the sound effect is, just so we can have a really quick WAV file to throw into the game and test out. So let's give it a try. All right, now it's time to record something. Hold on, let me get my microphone set up. All right, perfect. Jump! Now that we've recorded and bounced our WAV file, let's go ahead and open the WISE launcher again. Go to the WISE tab and press Launch WISE. After WISE is loaded, you'll see the Project Launcher window. Press the Open Other button and navigate your hard drive to the 3D Game Kit WISE project folder. Open that up and you will see the 3D Game Kit WISE underscore WISE project and in there, the WISE project session. Once the WISE project is loaded up, we're gonna go find the jump sound effect. So navigate in the Layouts menu to the Designer Layout. Now we're going to go find the main character, which is under Actor Mixer Hierarchy and Default Work Unit. You'll find the Ellen folder. In there, you will find a folder called Emote, which is where the jump sound effect is located. This is a random container called SFX underscore Ellen underscore Emote Jump. In there, there are three of the original sound effects. We can uncheck each one of those to turn off the original sound effects, and we're going to import your custom sound effect. Go ahead and drag in your own sound effect and drop it on the SFX Ellen Emote Jump random container. This will bring up the audio file importer screen. All of the defaults there are correct, so you can just go ahead and press import, and this will bring in your sound effect. You can test it out by clicking on it, pressing the space bar or the play button. Once you have your sound effect in WISE and have tested it out, all we need to do to put it into the game is generate the sound bank. Go to the Layouts menu and choose Sound Bank, and then make sure the Sound Bank underscore 3D Game Kit WISE sound bank is checked, along with the correct platform and language. Now all we need to do is press the Generate Selected button. This will convert all of your audio and create a sound bank for the game. To test this out, we can minimize WISE and go launch the game. With the application open, you should be able to start a new game and hear your sound. Now to test out your jump sound, all we need to do is press spacebar to jump. Jump! Of course, this sounds ridiculous, jump. but now that we've tested our setup, we can go through and put in our real sound design. Now this should get you started in recording your own sound effects for the 3D Game Kit WISE project. Go ahead and download everything and give it a try. If you have any questions or if you need a custom audio solution for your own game, Engine Audio is always there for you. You can find us on Twitter at Engine Audio or just message us at info at engineaudio.com. Thanks for checking out the project and we'll see you again next time.